Hello YouTube, Wired Zero here. In this video tutorial, I'm going to be showing you how to scan all wireless networks within a range and scanning all the stations slash devices that are connected to a specific Wi-Fi network, thus giving us the ability to clone a MAC address that is already connected and authenticated to a Wi-Fi network. This is for educational purposes only, and I will be doing this on my own personal Wi-Fi router. Once again, for educational purposes. I'll be using a TP-Link model TLWN722N wireless adapter and Kali Linux running in a virtual box. Kali's got all the tools built in to achieve everything that I'm going to be doing in this video tutorial. Kali can easily be run in live mode from a USB stick or a bootable CD. So let's go ahead and log in and get started. All right, now that we're logged in, what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and open up a terminal window. The first thing we want to do is find out what the name is of our Wi-Fi adapter we're going to be working with. In my case, it's the TP-Link. So we can find that out by typing if config. And we'll notice that mine is WLAN0. Yours is probably going to be different. It could be the same. Okay, so we know it's WLAN0. The first thing we're going to do is throw this in monitor mode. So we can do that by typing aramon-ng start WLAN0. <clears throat> now we have our Wi-Fi adapter in monitor mode. Okay, and we can tell this because we type in iwconfig and we'll see it right here. The new name is WLAN0mon. Okay, so we need to keep that in mind. So now let's go ahead and start aerodump by typing aerodump ng and then WLAN 0 MON. Now we're going to scan all the stations, I'm sorry, all the networks that are in range of our Wi Fi adapter. I'm looking for my personal Wi Fi adapter, which is Robert Pulson. So it should end up at the top. Okay, I'm going to hit Control C to stop this. So what we need to know now is the channel. Robert Pulson is my network. And the channel is 11. And now all I need is this MAC address. So I'm going to go ahead and highlight the MAC address of my Wi Fi, that, my um, router, copy it. Okay. And now what we're going to do is we're going to scan all the devices slash stations that are connected to my Wi Fi network, which is Robert Paulson. So we can achieve that by typing arrow dump. dash ng, and then the channel, which is channel 11, and then the uh, MAC address, which I paste, I copied, so I can paste it here, and then WLAN 0 mon. Now what we're doing is scanning all the stations that are connected to my Wi-Fi network. All right, so one of the devices on my network is right here. All right, there's two of them now. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and stop this by hitting Control C. Okay. I'm going to copy this one right here. Okay, now we need to get out of monitor mode. So we can type in aromon ng stop WLAN0 MON. Okay, we're now out of monitor mode. And we can see that here. Now we're back to WLAN0. So the next thing we want to do is we want to bring the Wi Fi adapter down. We do that by if config the name of the adapter, which is WLAN0, and then down. Okay. Now what we want to do is we want to clone the MAC address that we can we just copied. So we do that by typing MAC changer dash M and then we'll control shift V to paste in the new MAC address and then WLAN zero. Okay, now we changed it as you can see here. Alright, now let's bring the uh, network adapter back up. Okay. Now, if config a WLAN0, now we can see our new MAC address for that adapter. If we want to put the permanent MAC address back on, we just basically do the same thing with a different command. If config, let's bring the, the adapter down, and we can just do MAC changer. This time we could do P, and then we'll do WLAN0. And now we got our MAC address back. That's it. Thanks for watching.